What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Pokemon Legends Arceus and hey, before we kick off today's episode I want to thank you for over 15,000 likes on the first episode. That episode now has over 600,000 views. Let's continue forward here uh, towards this way and we're going to bring out the, this dude here and uh, ride. Uh, I might need to take a look at the map. I don't know how to get there. Let's take a look at the map. Uh, okay. I'm going to put a marker here because this is <laughs> another Abdallah satchel. Put a marker there because that will be on my way, maybe. It looks like I go through here, but I might end up... I truly don't know how to get there. Let's let's just see where this takes us. We might go this way. If we go this... You think I go this way and around? Maybe so. Here, let me uh, go ahead and uh, switch out. Throw this guy over here. I went ahead and already rested and organized my items and all that stuff, so... Shouldn't be what... I forget which way I came from. This might get me there. This might not. There's a wisp up there or whatever. Uh, so let's just kind of uh, get down to the ground. Uh, maybe capture these if I need to capture more. That's, is that guy sleeping? Oh, there we go. He, his back's going to be to me. I, I love this. And this... Oh, shoot. This will do. Nope. Didn't catch either of them, dude. Let's go. Oh, jeez. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. Climb. That's right. We're supposed to climb. Awesome. That's how we're supposed to get up there. I forgot about this. Okay, so yeah. Let's climb out of here, dude. That's perfect. Let's go. Let's get to the top. This is this is how you do it. Oh, wow. Uh, Hold on. Hold on, this guy's here for real, dude. There you go. Maybe that'll work, maybe it won't. Caught it, nice, Onyx. No, what, don't, don't climb that, what the heck? I like how I can just be this cat and just walk around. It's too bad I can't throw my Pokemon while being that. Jesus, a big one, that's a Steelix, right? What is next to him? There's some other flying creature next to him. That Steelix is probably... <laughs> I, don't, I really don't want to ascend on these things. All right, all right, hold on. Let's let's take a take a take a mellow. Shoot! Stop! Dang it! I wonder if I could use a light ball for that, maybe. Is he looking at me? I can't tell. Now it's, is it looking at me now? Where's its face? I literally can't tell where its face is. I'm gonna try to capture whatever the heck it is though. All right, cool. Please work. Nice, dude, Chimeco. Now what about this up here? This is uh, this is gonna be important too, right? Oh crap! Uh, thought about it, but it didn't work out to my benefit. Uh, hey, let's uh, grab some of that, and then let's go. Yeah, let's got a couple crunchy salts. You know, this is, you know, this is pretty cool, honestly. Now I'm a lot, I'm gonna be a lot more mobile. I'm gonna be able to climb a lot more things, obviously. So it looks like we'll find a satchel over this way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. I'm gonna try to capture whatever the heck this is over here. Have I have I already caught one of these? It'll tell me, right? That is wrong. Hold on, switch to that. There we go. Nose pass. Oh, I caught I caught a bronze ore. Is that a Caught one without being spotted. There's so much over here, dude. 
I'll try to catch, catch another one of these because I've only caught Bronzong. This is, is this an alpha? No, this is level 53. I think I'm in like a, I might be in a place that's, that's not going to be good for me. Uh, that may not stick. I'm going to ride out just anyway. Nope. Yeah. So first up. There's a satchel over here. So that'll get me, uh, you're welcome, Abdallah. I just don't know. I mean, like, can I? Should I capture the? I mean, it's like. Level 54. It, it, none of this may stick at all. Well, I want to see about this little guy over here. Why does it keep switching my away from the balls here? This is really annoying. Oh, it's a sneeze, sneezel right there. There you go. Oh, that sticks. Nice. I do need to, uh, you know, whoa, uh, level up before next time around, I think. Let's see about this guy. What the heck is this guy? That may not stick either. Nope. I thought it might, but it didn't. Okay, yeah. Uh, let me just go over here. Maybe he won't find me. Oh, shoot! God, he's freaking right there. Okay, okay, up here, up here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, Sneezer, let's go. We're out of here. Oh, there's, a, there's a wisp up there or whatever. Dude, look at that guy. I think he hears something. Can I snipe him from the top? Where'd he go? Oh, there he is, okay. Uh, instead of descend, how about just don't, yeah, here we go. No, 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 no. Can I not just stay up here? Yeah, I can. You think you can see me? Oh, this, this one's gonna be, yeah, that's an alpha, dude. What the heck? Dang it. Ah, <sighs> freaking fall damage. What is this? What is that? What is that? Please get him. I'm just, I, there's so much new stuff I'm finding. Oh, okay, I didn't even stick. All right, what about this guy over here? Do I have a, uh, that's a haunter. And this is a level, uh, everything's so high level. What is going on? Am I not supposed to be here? I mean, Can I even catch this high of level? You know what I mean? Okay, yeah, I did. I caught a haunter. Good. Caught at night. Good. There's so much going on. I'm trying to... <laughs> don't, don't mess with me. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right, hold on, hold on. Do you see me? He doesn't even see me. What happened, dude? Level 55. Why is everything so crazy high level? Okay, caught two. What is going on? Have I, like, stumbled? Have I done something wrong in the wrong order? And, like, now everything's, like, super hard? Like, what the heck? Um, let me take a look really quick. Because, I mean, I, I'm i catching things that, that are really high level. Let me look over here. Uh, Pokemon, oh, so I'm not even high enough level for them to obey me, so I'm catching things that won't, won't obey me. That's what it means. Remove this from the map really quick. Wrong. Remove, where's my map? Where's my freaking, there we go, we don't need this. I'm going up to uh, over here. I'm glad I have Sneezer or whatever his name is. I really wish you could just throw Pokemon from the back of another Pokemon. That would make some sense to me, right? Uh, hi. Man, there's so many big guys out here, dude. Why is it... Alright, hold on. I'm gonna get close to this guy, maybe. Maybe. 
Who knows if it'll stick, but I mean, like, at least I tried. Nope, didn't work. We are off uh, over... No, no, what? Came off over this way. This is a wonderful place. Okay, that looks cool over there. Hold on, nope. Dang it. I want to catch that if I can. I don't think it's facing me. Is it facing me? <laughs> it saw me, clearly. Nice, caught a Rotom. Oh, wow. Okay, hold on. Voltorb could be mine. Nope. Dang it. He sees me. Do I have this guy? Yeah. Excuse me. We're moving forward with the story. Here we go. Am I really ready to fight this thing? First, let's uh, let's end this really quick, and uh, not end this. Let's push this out here. See what is encountered. What the heck is that? A startled word or what? Warmadam. Uh, let's do. We could do a. Uh, let's do a weak flame wheel, and see if that leaves enough energy for us to catch him. Okay. Okay. Cool. Psychic move. Don't don't worry about it. I'll try to capture him now. Uh, yes, great ball. Do it. I like the fireworks. All right, I've caught a lot of Pokemon. Some, some, something still sees me. I'm going to go over here and talk to you. Smelly Melly. Welcome to the Moonview Arena, the seat of Lord Electrode. All right. I know I've not exactly been supportive of you reaching this place, but part of me did hope you'd make it. Call me contradictory all you like, Galaxy Grunt, but such is life. Embracing the complexity of both ourselves and the world can only help us grow. As a member of the Diamond Clan, my highest calling is to please Almighty Sinnoh. And right now, that means I must protect my lord by stopping you where you stand. If you still wish to defeat me and gain entry to Electrode's seat, you and your little Pokemon are welcome to give it your best shot. Let's go, Skunk Tank. Give them another whiff of your silent deadliness. Here we go. Let's do it. So, yeah, I should have healed T-Dog, but anyway. I'll switch to whatever is best. Oh, there's a bat here too? What the heck, dude? So T-Dog and the Skunk, then Scorp. There's three things here? Where's the... Th God dang it. Uh, let's fight uh, effective... How do I switch, uh, switch, 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 ZL? No, no, that's not it, ZL. Super effective if I use rollout, but that's not a great move because I'm gonna be stuck using rollout. But this, flame wheel is super effective and so is pretty much everything. So let's do a, that's level 22. Let's let's do an agile style flame wheel against Scorpy. Can't believe I have to fight three things at once, but that's okay, I have multiple Pokemon. That guy is gone. And with the Agile, I'll probably get to move sooner rather than later. So, here comes an Agile. He went Agile as well. And killed me. Great. <laughs> Great. All right. Uh, K-Dog. Uh, let's see what you got. What's effective here? Everything's just effective, but nothing's, like, great. I got a, a shiny Bronzong, though, in my... in my. But he's only level 38. Uh, so, uh, let's see. Let's go, let's bring, let's bring K-Dog out. I don't know why. Oh, come on, really? Hypnosis? I'm drowsy now. Come on, dude, of course it's effective. I didn't know you had fire. Freaking killing me, guys. S-Dog, get out of here. Everything's passing out, fainting. All right, so I get a move in Zubat, then I get a move. So if I attack Zubat, that would be best for me. 
Uh, so let's fight. Let's just do an air slash, because I'm going to get a move. Let's do this one. Good. I think I get another move, right? So close combat could work. I don't know. We're both we're both of equal level, so I don't know how well that's actually gonna work. Let's do let's do an air slash. Maybe we'll do another one. Okay, we'll do close combat next. Yeah. Okay. One hundo. All right. That took care of him. And the battle's been decided. I wish, uh, you know. That was pretty good, though. Don't worry about it. It was pretty good. Let's make one thing clear. I didn't lose. You may have won, but there's a difference. I just lacked uh, time. Yes, I'm afraid there simply wasn't enough time for me to raise my Pokemon nice and strong. Ah, uh, could this be why Adamant is always going on and on about time being a precious thing? My word, the Diamond Clan and Almighty Sinnoh truly have our never-ending founts of wisdom. Yes, yes, I know what comes next. You want to know what pleases Lord Electrode so you can make some bombs for it. Well, I'm afraid I won't be able to help you. Because I've completely forgotten what Electrode likes. She's being bitter. I'm like, no way. <laughs> What's the matter? Upset? Too bad anger doesn't make bombs. <laughs> Melly's really giving you the runaround, isn't he, Z-Dog? I thought, thought Melly was a girl. I guess it's my fault for not telling you in advance what Electrode likes. So here's the. Adam, man. Hold on, really quick. Uh, let's see. Uh, Melly Pokemon. Doop, doop. Yeah, gender male. I thought this was a girl for real. I was catching feelings and everything. Adam, man. What now? I could hear you just now, you know. Are you really going to tell this little noodle what he needs to find just like that? Lest we all forget, you're the leader of the Diamond Clan. Why do you bother with these galaxy louts? Use your eyes, Melly. Haven't you even looked at your frenzied lord? Don't you feel even a twinge of how it suffers fighting to control the energy that's bursting out of it? I see nothing but a Pokemon overcome with joy at being among Almighty Sinnoh's chosen ones. Anyway, it's not like trials and suffering are always a cause for doom and gloom. These things exist to help us grow. I'm sorry, Melly. I can't write off these frenzies as some trial from Almighty Sinnoh. That's why I'm doing the best I can to help out Z-Dog here. This is bigger than what team or clan we belong to. Oh, and by the way, I wasn't going to tell him what he that he needs Crunchy Salt. I was going to go right ahead and give it to him. Now, it's time to make some bombs, so lend a hand, both of you. All right. I like that it's snowing right now. <laughs> that frown. Fine. At the end of the day, let none say that the great Melly shirked his duties as warden. I'll help make your precious bombs. Gonna have some smelling salts. All right. Let's fight this beast. There. I made you a practically infinite supply of bombs, so chuck all that you want at Electrode. But, I don't, uh, but don't underestimate my lord's strength. I very much doubt the likes of you can quell it. I'll give it a go. I hope I don't die. That's my thing. I hope I don't die fighting. Am I going to be able to heal my Pokemon? So, even knowing you're doomed to fail, you still wish to pit yourself against Electrode? I'm ready to battle. Or wait, am I, though? I guess it doesn't matter if my Pokemon are healed. Heh, <laughs> you, you've a great deal more pluck than you have since. I'll give you that. A word of advice. Don't stop moving while you're battling Electrode, or you'll be dead in no time. Hold on. Wait Wait a second. Do I... Are my Pokemon alive? Because I, I want them to gain an XP from this battle. I might need to revive them in the middle of this. I don't know. If even possible. Another tree. Is he in the tree? Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Whoa! <laughs> Lord of the Hollow Electrode! Uh, so my question again if I can if I'm able to pause this or do whatever I need to do um, Are my Pokemon alive? They're alive. Okay, great. So let's just uh, do what I need to do in the What the heck is that? What the heck is that? What the heck is that? Uh, 
I hate it. I hate this. What is going on? Dude, are you, are you for real sending two of these at me? Dude, what the heck? I don't, I, I don't even think I've hit him once yet. All right, come on now. Jeez Louise. Holy cow, this is a terrible fight. All right, let's go, let's go. I'm not gonna send a Pokemon and do battle, I'm just gonna do this. Dang it, ow. Holy cows, dude. These, why are these all chasing me? I'm always on the run with this. What the heck? Dang it. Ow. Dang it. Okay, I'm getting hurt. I'm getting pretty hurt. <laughs> Get me the heck out of here, dude. Are you freaking kidding me right now? There we go. All right. No Pokemon coming in. I'm just going to send a bunch of balls. Dang it. Crap. Okay. Oh, I'm, I'm actually really hurt right now. Oh my god. It's really raining this stuff down, isn't it? Shoot! Holy crap, I'm just running. This blue one is after me, I hate it. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna try to outrun this if I can. Oh no, oh no, oh no. All right, nice, nice, nice. I think I can finish him off really quick. Maybe, maybe not. Dang it. Hold on. Did I get him? I got him. I think I got him. Whew. Goodness gracious. That was tougher than I thought it was going to be. I wonder if I'll ever have to fight these by throwing Pokemon. He still looks mad. There you go. We leveled up some. Not like a lot, but some. <laughs> Is he happy? I can't even tell. I got, I got the zap plate from Electrode. All right, see ya. Oh, for shame, what utter calamity. I agreed to make those accursed bombs, yes, but now that Almighty Sinnoh's precious blessing has vanished forever, it's just so unbearably sad. Is that how you see it? Electrode looks relieved to me. Glad it's suffering ended, probably. Oh, come on, Adam, man. Seriously? That's just your wishful thinking, nothing more. All your preaching doesn't ruffle me one bit, but if Almighty Sinnoh grows angry with me because of this, I don't know what I'll do. I arrive right on schedule. It's just in time, dude. Now, what did you bother coming back for? Only to say I recalled some things after Z-Dog did me the honor of traveling with me. 
The things to do with the world where I believe I lived before my memories were lost. Most people there caught Pokemon, lived with them, formed supportive partnerships with them. And then there were the Pokemon trainers. The ones we called Pokemon trainers were truly devoted to their craft. They always looked towards the next challenge and had Pokemon battles every chance they got, all to help themselves and their Pokemon grow. Through battle, trainers forge bonds of understanding with their Pokemon and with their opponents and their Pokemon too, with everything I suppose. If Pokemon and people work together, we can forge a new path forward. We'll be lost to history if we go on believing only Pokemon can be strong or if we go on fearing them instead of understanding them. Interesting. Was your world like Ingo described too, Z-Donk? I don't know. It sure was. Sure, it, it was. Yeah, let's spread the message of hope. I never have thought such a world could exist. Oh, once again, the brilliant Warden Melly has realized something rather clever. It's not just my Pokemon that need to be strong, it's me as well. The greater my valor and might, the more my Pokemon can reach their potential. I wonder if Almighty Sinnoh will be pleased once I've achieved exactly that. Hey Adaman, share with me again the wisdom of Almighty Sinnoh passed down among our clan. Alright, alright, open your ears, shut that big mouth and listen well, my friend. Give not into sorrow, give not into anger, only offer friendship to those around you. Give not into sorrow, give not into anger, bring not Almighty Sinnoh to sorrow. For that is when time's flow will cease. And there you have it. Bravo, excellent. Please, all of you, do your best and run towards the destination at even at an even higher state. Of course, your higher state is clear, Z-Dog. It surely lies with the next lord. Now, this time I really will make the complete return trip to Jubilife Village. Perhaps with someone like Z-Dog to show that Pokemon need to not be feared, the people of Hizui will <laughs> Hizui <laughs> will find new tracks forward. Now, begging your pardon, I owe Commander Kam Kam Kamado my report. Until next time, Z-Dog. Alright, until next time. Can we find a way to honor our past while also forget forging a better future? Maybe that's what Almighty Sinnoh really wants from us. After all, it rules over all time, and it created everything there is. Be ready to shield your eyes, Galaxy Grunt. I'm going to polish up both myself and Electrode until our strength and brilliance are blinding. Great. Now we got to report back to Commander Kamado. I'm going to take a slower path because I know that I have more more things to catch. And so I... What was that over there? What the heck? Oh, Sneezer. Sure, you know what? Let's climb up here with Sneezer. What the heck? Can I climb that tree too? I don't even know. Can I climb up here? This looks like an interesting wall. I'm a little low on great balls. I can't, that must be too high to go. Boom! Oh god, I keep forgetting about fall damage in this game, dude. Uh, let's see, let's switch over to... All right, who, who's around here that I need to worry about? Oh, that looks like an icy area up there, dude. I don't know if that's where we're supposed to go or not. No, we're supposed to go this way. Let's stick to, uh, you know, let's stick to, stick to it. I might fast travel, but really, I think I should, I should take some time here and, uh, you know, try to capture some things that I, I don't have. Like these guys over here. See if we get him. Nice. The back hit was important, I guess. Oh, there's one over here. Let's wait until he looks away, I think. There's an alpha over here, dude. That could be my new L-Dog. If I were to get a ground or something, that might work. Uh, right. Uh, do I have anyone with ground-based moves? Let's see. 
Do I have anyone strong enough? He's probably like a level 60 or something. Let's take a look over here. Uh, check summary. Rock. But no ground on me. So I don't know about that, man. I mean, that would be such a nice thing to capture. Probably totally ruined me. I might have to run away. Let me run by him just to see what level he is. God dang, dude. 55, that's not terrible, right? Oh, dude, there's there's other things here. Hold on. That's not great. Is he on me still? Is he still on me? Is he still on me like Lazani? It, if it's just him, I'm going to be happy. All right. The Alpha Lux Ray is filled. Crunch. Yep. Great. Thank you. This may not work. This may not work. Uh, switch over to him. It's going to go in order, I guess. If I'm able to get any of these guys, it'll be a tremendous thing. Absorb. 70. 80. Let's do an 80. Strong style. I mean, that seems pretty good, right? So now what? I just try to capture him? Let's try a normal. Let's just try a regular move. You know, maybe I'll faint him. I don't know. But let's uh, let's let's do a close. Let's do a quick attack. A strong style quick attack. If this if this makes him faint, then I'll just be like, well, okay, well I tried. That does not. Now let's see if I can capture him. Yep. All of my guys are dying over this. Uh, let's try L Dog himself. And then basically I'm going to be cycling through my Pokemon while I now try to capture him with a Great Ball. I'm only going to get a couple of, of, of attempts here before I before I just run away. Yeah, that's that's didn't seem like it was going to work. Okay, okay, I get another cha another shot then. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Then we can just move on. Fast travel back to camp. Rest. Nope. Didn't think so necessarily. He's enraged, dude. What? Okay. Yep. Fainted. Uh, let's send out Floatzel. And I'll try for one more capture. I don't know if this is going to work. I really don't. It see, I, I'm betting it doesn't work now because he, he like ramped up everything. Yeah, yeah, this guy's dead, dude. Too far from battle. No, no big deal. No big deal. I'm gonna try to capture this really quick while I'm here. Dang it. Okay, I gotta go. I gotta go. Dang. Okay. Uh, let's let's head out. But be careful in the process, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, everyone's fainted, so... <laughs> Alright, fast travel time. Oh, there's a camp here? Oh no, I can't go there. Returning to the camp to uh, rest up a little bit. And, uh, yeah. I like to use a rest. Just a little while. I can also use more great balls. I don't think he sells them, though. Can I craft any more great balls? Oh, first up, I have this. Nice. Okay. And then uh, over here. Craft. Craft, yeah, I can I can make some more. I can make a lot more. Perfect. Okay, let me let me just see how many Pokemon do I have right now? Ten. Okay, yeah, just report the findings. It's 
It's not as many as I hoped, honestly, but there a lot of them are new. And so let's see where we're at right now. I don't know what kind of, uh, you know, things I've discovered or whatever. Scorpy, Typhlosion. He's still level 8, really. I've been using him a lot. Yeah, that's not even close. I really, I mean, I think before I go back, I need to definitely catch a lot more to level up. Oh, you quelled Lord Electro. Splendid job. Oh, come on. I don't want to go back yet. I don't want to go back. I want to go out and do my thing. Or something, right? Jubilife City. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's, let's head back out. Let's see what we got. Where do I want to go? So I was just here at the Coronet Highland, so I'm just going to go back there. Because I know there's a whole bunch of opportunity here to, to capture Pokemon, get things done. Complete different things, and uh, let's just see how that plays out for us. You, you anyone to talk to? Bruma. Ursaloon is a real champ when it comes to digging up treasure. He'll find all sorts of nifty stuff. Oh, yeah, I know. I knew that. Break that open. Thank you. Yeah, so I really don't need... I don't think need to... Deal with these guys. Okay, now I have some more... Okay, okay, now I have some more uh, things to, to look at. And that would be where? That would be over here. over here. This doesn't really give me a lot of speed or anything like that, so. I think I'm more in it for the speed, honestly, so. Oh my god. Uh, what am I doing? Sometimes I forget the controls. Uh, switch over to X. What is this guy? He's level 9. What do you think I got to do to get to a uh, number of caught in the evening? Uh, catch two more. Then I'll be good. Freaking god dang it. They all left. Are you joking, kidding me right now? Oh, okay. Okay, that makes a little more sense. Go back to level 10, though, so. I'm not too worried about anything like that. What the heck, dude? Oh, he sees me, he sees me. Go. There's a wisp up here. Let's go get it. And then, can I just jump into the water here? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. Let's go with water. Water will work, right? So I can be this fish thing or whatever. All right, now I can be Sneasler and really explore this area. King Leaf or whatever. Where's, uh... Where do you think the satchel? There it is. There you go. Someone died over here, I guess. Alright, I'm pretty sure I've Psyduck maxed out, so... Who dis? Uh, he's level 6 only. Oh, what? Wrong button. Uh, what level is this guy? This guy's level 38. I should have looked at his stats before just fighting him, but I am going to fight him. Okay. He's a water. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Critical hit. Uh, let's then swap Pokemon, and we will use, uh, maybe this guy. Cricketoon. Go, K-Dog. Uh, let's do Absorb. Super effective, right? 
There you go. Another headbutt. Gosh dang, this guy sucks. He's super absorb. Give me all your stuff. There you go, there you go. Now the goal is to catch these guys, so. That's something I probably need to focus on. Uh, what do we got? I don't have hardly anything. We got like a super potion. All right, super potion. There you go. Looking at the uh, the map now. It's a long journey. Oh, what? We're right. I got that guy. Okay, doke. Uh, so I gotta go way far away to get the next satchel. But you know, the journey, that's what it's all about, right? The journey. So let's see what we can do. And go, let's let's go on a journey. Um, I guess we're gonna go, yeah, I guess we are gonna go on a journey. Let's, I was thinking about this just, but no, I think I need to. Uh, the only thing is I already have, you know, these guys. Okay, hold on. Whoa, shoot, shoot, shoot. Gosh, I always hit the wrong button. I'm trying to, like, I'm trying to duck down when, I, when these guys see me. And they don't see me because I'm in the grasses. God dang it, dude. What the? I hate when I just waste the balls. That's, like, my, my least favorite thing. This guy's gonna either be here and dang it, he wasn't caught. He wasn't caught. Surely he doesn't know where I am, right? I think he might see me. He might see me. <laughs> Alright. Uh what do we got? These are all just regular effective. Let's go. Strong style. All right, high horsepower. Gosh dang it, dude, what the heck? And bulldoze after that, god dang it. So embarrassed, Sea dog faints all the freaking time. S dog, get out here. I will beat you. I need to find out what his, uh... I need to find out what I need to do against him to to get credit for whatever. Oh, defeat it with, with fighting type moves. Good, good. Um, let me go into here again to revive and heal. All right, and then uh, over here. Great, I just don't want to return and not have another star upgrade, you know what I mean? I'm gonna run so that if he's not caught, it was caught. Good. <laughs> All right, and then I'll grab that. There's another one of these bears. If I can, is it one more I need to capture, or what? What is the what is the deal here? I wish I could just look him up right now. You know what I mean? Like, I, I wish there was not, I'd have to like get super duper close to him to see him or whatever. Okay, now I can look at him, right? All right, wh what do we need to do? Um, Defeat with fighting style moves. I need to capture one more and then I can defeat him with fighting style moves and then maybe we'll get him done or whatever. If this doesn't work, then I'm gonna be ready with uh, S Dog. Nope, got him. Cool. Okay. Well, uh, 
Dire Shroom. Oh yeah, we went through this uh, tunnel here, didn't we? Let's see what I can find in here once more. There's a, there's a wisp up there. Now is that a red eye guy? Is that guy red eyes or? Freaking god dang it. He moved. Got him. Obviously, I need to ascend over there, but... God! Alright. Bronze ore, I could catch more. Uh, defeat with fire-type moves. So if I were to fight him, then uh, we're looking at using T-Dog. But I also do need to capture them, so... Nice. The other bronze was over here. Fire type move, defeat. Let's go. I should have tried to fight him unaware. I keep forgetting about that capability here. So let's do a strong flame wheel. Let's just take care of a couple more things. Got him. Let me climb. There we go. So, uh, what's on the other side of this? I forget. Oh yeah, these guys. Okay, hold on, let me... Okay, oh, that's an alpha, right? He don't see me, he don't see me! How am I, how am I with these guys? Research level 10, darn. How am I with these these dudes then? Research level eight somehow. Let's catch one more. Maybe we'll get another research level. It's gonna be so hard to get this guy without being spotted. It has such a nice range to it, so. Nice. Alright, oh, nope, that's not who I want to be. Uh, let's switch it over to him. So I'm looking at going, oh my god. So I'm going all the way over here for. Oh no, th wait, what's next? Hold on, no, no, I. No, I put a marker over here. What? I'm so confused what I just did. All right, hold on over here. One, one second. What am I doing? What, what's the next thing on the marker? Then? Oh God! Hi. Uh. Wait, what is it? What's it telling me to do? Did the? I'm a little confused. Let me see about this one second. Have I caught th enough of these yet? <laughs> I was looking right at him. There is five, no, two sixteen over there. What is this guy over here? This guy seems a little sleepy, doesn't he? Is he asleep? 
I think he might be asleep. That's gotta be a catch, right? That's like a guaranteed catch. Hunt number three of four. What? Oh, there's one. There you go. Alright, so. Now, this is interesting. I, I like how you can just sw switch really quick between these. Uh, nope. Whole bunch of these. Oh, so, hold on. So, if I catch this one, then I got four of four. Okay. Without being spotted. So, this one, that might be the next level then. And then these things I've already caught enough of, right? The answer is yes. So what is, what am I going, when I go, have I returned back to where I was? What's going on? Have I returned back to a camp or something? I'm so confused. Oh geez, get out of here. What is this? This is, oh. Okay, so this is where we, okay. Where am I on the map? Oh, I'm over here. I made it all the way back. So I, okay. <laughs> how many have I caught? Just curious, how many have I caught really quick? Nine, no. No, I need a little bit more. And it's gonna take, it's probably gonna take a lot more than just 10 even. But you know, getting some things complete will make all the difference, you know, to me. So, no, they wanted me to go over here, like further, right? Okay, so pretty sure I've caught these, so I'm just gonna walk by and uh, uh, yeah, so here we go. Let me uh, let me actually get to where I was going. I don't know what the heck I, I did. I think I was confused by the marker. I was like, what is this? what is this? Now this is a peak. And then there's uh, these guys over here. So I need to catch one of these guys, probably. And I'll try. Hold on, research level. Yeah, if we can catch another one or defeat another one with a grass type move. And so with the grass let's say with the grass type move. So that would mean to me, uh, maybe he has a grass type move. But this could be a really difficult fight, depending on what level this guy is. Should try to catch him unawares, but so we're gonna defeat him with a grass type move. Aqua Tail really sucks for me. He's the only grass type move guy I have, so I hope this is really nice. This probably won't be nice enough at all. This is gonna be. No, this isn't gonna work. I don't have. I mean, that's barely enough. Because he's gonna hit him with the Aqua Tail, and freaking faint him. I hate it. I hate it, dude. I'm out. I'm out. All right, let's let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let me go ahead and uh, revive again. He's really the only grass type thing I have, right? I really need to. Uh, yeah. Trying to get out of here. Huh? 
So, um... Yeah, I guess I... Okay. I'm just gonna go get the satchel. And maybe, like, going out to these these areas I, I haven't frequented too much, maybe we'll get me some... Uh, some exposure to more Pokemon. Okay, like, right here. There's a freaking Pokemon there. Uh... Okay. Oh, freaking dang it, dude. Okay, Graveler. Who? Okay, this is a rock ground. Jesus. Okay. I, I haven't even obtained any of these guys, so... Okay, they don't see me right now. I do want to sneak up on them if I can. But they won't freaking stay still, dude. Uh, nope. Alright, so if he's a ground... Uh, Gra Graveler is a ground type, right? Graveler Pokemon is a drum roll, please. He's a rock ground. So a rock ground type. Let me pull up my Pokemon type chart. A rock ground type will be uh, weak against water. Okay, yeah, that's right. Water, grass, ice. So if I if I bring out Floatzel and kind of try to hit him with it, then maybe that might work. At the very least, I'll have uh, some. What level is this guy? 45, okay, we're, we're even. Um, Aqua Jet, but this one's super effective Water Pulse. I'm gonna do a strong style, and then if it if it doesn't land or whatever, or if it does land. Okay, he's gone, he's gone. Defeated Graveler. Two of three defeated. The rest of these guys. There's one over here. I do. I do want to try to capture capture one too, but I need to defeat like one more as well. But I cannot even try to defeat him. I guess. But maybe I can capture him in uh, after a battle. Let's do a regular water pulse. Maybe I can then do a, a ball to capture him. Nope, he's gone. Okay. So, uh, I'm getting I'm getting really sidetracked here. Let's do a weak one, then maybe I can capture him. Uh, fight water pulse, but the the agile style. Even that's a critical hit. Okay, that, that was good. Defeat another Graveler. Not catching them, just de defeating them. So, uh, let's head over here then. Okay, I don't know if I have any... any skunky boys over here. I feel like I've fought him enough, but that may not be enough for... What the heck, dude? Uh, no, okay, sure. Oh, there's some stuff down here that I haven't caught. Oh, yeah, I remember these. I was supposed to capture some of these, right? It's like all of them. Okay, hold on, let me go. So many. Are these all alphas? I have a quest to do something like this. Unobtained. Throw it. Is that an alpha? 
Dang it. Stay still. Dang it, just hit him. Dang it, are you freaking kidding me? Dang it. Whoa! He's up here too. I need to crap more of those things. <laughs> Caught three. Um, without without being spotted. Let me uh, let me see. So let me. Uh, hopefully, I can craft some more. I mean, I mean, I have enough materials to craft more. Okay, I can craft another fourteen. Good. So I was like kind of losing some here for a second. What? Are these all alphas? <sighs> I don't even know. Looks like I got a bunch of alphas. Let's let's head up here. Okie doke. Um I'm gonna wait for him to turn around and then try to sneak up on him. Turn around. <sighs> uh, obtained. I'm gonna go find the satchel over here. There's another sneezer over here. Is this thing still on my case? I don't know where he went. There you go. Catch more of those, please. Those are pretty good. There's another one over there. Dang it, dude, he saw me. All right, there's the pouch. So I have caught, you know, more stuff. There's, there's gonna be another pouch, right? Let's go up over here. That's not even, I didn't even mark it close enough. Let's ride on it. There we go. So let's go over here. Oh, 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 oh. What about these fish? Oh, is that a... Are those magic carps? You know, I can... Uh, I can catch these. I don't know if I've caught any of them. There you go. These are new. These are easy to catch, too. There you go. Worth it. I somehow caught a large specimen. Uh, hold on. Let me get down here. Who sees me? Who sees me? I don't even know who sees me. Oh. <laughs> Let me, uh, just get out of here really quick. Where's the next marker? Over here, okay. Let's see what I can find. There's a sa there's there it is over there. I still haven't caught one of these, have I? No, because everything I do, uh let me here, let me switch over. Nope, nope, nope. Ow.
All right, uh, Graveler. So let's do an Aqua Jet then. And then I'll try to capture you. Okay. Rock Slide isn't gonna mess with me too much. Dang, really? I don't, under, I never, I, I don't understand this stuff. Uh, great ball, use it, get a grab. I don't think I have a graveler. Is that what we, what we decided? Is I don't have one of these? But I might have one now. There you go. Maybe I had one. I don't know. No, that's one of one. Okay, don't have enough space in the satchel, so that's good. I could try to make my way up over here before doing anything else. Which would be this way. <laughs> a little, a little twerp. So we gotta we gotta ascend that. It's a big mountain to go up. Why am I on a tree? Let's go up this waterfall. Uh, well, this mountainside, whatever. Am I gonna run into like a limit on how high I can go with this? Seems like no. That's the answer I was looking for. I really don't want to mess with that, but what's what's underneath, you think? Oh, a nose pass. Okay, hi. Uh, my float tool's really weak, so let's just try to blast them really quick. I don't want to mess with them. I just want to beat them. I caught one, but you know. He's level 56 defeated, dude. That was, thank gosh. Thank goodness. Okay, and then uh, let me, I, I could go over here, everyday items, and get a potion, super potion. Use it to heal Floatzel, because he's you know been useful against some of these rock types. Dude, look at that. Oh yeah, this this is uh, this is something over here, isn't it? I think I can just hit this thing from the top. How good of a throw do you think I am? I'm not. What a waste. Ha! Oh, that didn't even... Dang it, that didn't even work. Um. Hold on, there's a... Uh... There's a, uh, uh, what am I saying? There's a, there was a wisp here. There you go, 12 wisps remaining in the area. Really? Shoot, are you freaking kidding me? Get up. No, what, what, what's happening? Go, 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 what? What? I, I couldn't move, I was like, I'll be back down there. Maybe I could have caught the Gyarados. I don't know. Um, let's see. We do have to go all the way over there. Can I heal, please, before? I know I'm exhausted. Can I just heal? Is that a possibility? Can I heal? There you go. Getting better. Dang, I had a shot at that, I think. Dude. Fine, we'll fight, we'll fight. I don't know, I, have I beat one of you before, Sneasel? Man, he's strong, poison jab right off the bat, not very effective, but still really hurt me. Uh, super effective aerial ace. Okay. Close combat's gonna ruin me. Oh, it doesn't have no effect. Does that? Yeah, that's right. Good. Let's do another aerial ace. There you go. That's what I'm all about. Where's this bug dude? I want to capture him if if he lets me. Dang it! I think he sees me. Unobtained. Level 54, unobtained. Freaking 
freaking stupid. So dumb. This freaking tree got in my way, dude. Dude, another one of these? What the hell? This is, this is a little bit tougher than I, I'm wanting to fight right now. I can always capture these later once they're not going to just ruin me. Once I have stronger balls. Alright, does anyone actually see me here? What is over here? I hear something big. Oh yeah, this guy. Gosh. Unobtained. Maybe we can obtain him. Maybe we can't. Got it. Nice. Chingling. I do like making the progress that I'm making. But I'm also running low on balls still. But we got two. Let's go. We got to find another, uh, another thing. Okay, so I've been I've been here. Obviously, let's go find the uh, find what we're, what we're. There's gonna be a satchel here somewhere. Dang it, dude! I freaking went up in the sky. Oh god, no, 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 no! Am I paralyzed? Get out of there! Get out of there! Grab the satchel. Let's go. Abdallah, I'm getting your satchels for you. You better appreciate this. I'm being targeted like no other. And uh, now that no one's after me, I can fast travel back to here. And then I guess that might be enough to turn in. Maybe. Let's see how many how many Pokemon do I have? Twenty. That's perfect. Yes. I don't know if this will be enough to you know proceed onwards. You know, but I hopefully got some some things done. Uh, okay, Floatzel still could use a little bit more Gravelers, level 7 only. But, yes, there it is. There it is. We got a promotion. So let's go back, report in about, uh, you know, capturing Electrode or whatever. Not capturing, uh, quelling a Frenzy le Electrode. Oh, geez. And then, uh, you know, I don't know if there's anything else. So what other things did I have to do? There's a long list. Let's just uh, let's just head out. Don't have to do all the side quests. I don't think so. At least. So, uh, what's up? Show the Pokédex. We made some progress, and then we earned a star. So I'm now five stars, which is like halfway to ten, which seems to be the max. And then with this, you have officially attained the rank of 5th star in the Galaxy X Expedition team. You can now use Wing Balls. Pokemon of up to level 65 will also obey your orders reliably in battle. The rewards you earn for your survey reports will be more generous now, too. Have this as well. Another recipe. Is this for Wing Balls? Indeed it is. And then, uh, yeah, I'll keep dedicating myself. I'll pull from the board. A nose past the guy the way. The sea's legend. Alright, we'll we'll see about that eventually, you know. Ah, jolly good choice there, Z Dog. I see you've taken on that request I posted. Let me fill you in right away. I was strolling alongside Prelude Beach the other day when I saw something swimming a little way out from the shore. Rather regrettably it disappeared before I could snap a picture, but I can only assume this mysterious swimmer was some sort of Pokemon. From the way it swam, it seemed to be drifting on the ocean currents. Now, if I'm not mistaken, from the seas behind Jubilife that would take it all the way to the Cobalt Coastlands. This rather leaves me wondering if the Pokemon was headed there for some specific purpose. Given the circumstances, I was thinking that if we spoke to the good warden Iskin of the Diamond Clan, we might learn more. 
All right. Iskins here. Cool. I got your message, Professor Laventon. So uh, you're looking for a Pokemon that was swimming towards the Cobalt Coastlands, yes? Well, um, I'm, I'm very sorry, but I can't tell you much based on that alone. But well, there is one thing I can tell you. I've heard that long ago the Cobalt Coastlands was known as the as the East Sea, and a princely Pokemon was said to live in the waters there. The story of this princely Pokemon can be found in a tome called the Sea's Legend, but no one knows much about either the tone or its tail beyond what I just told you. Tome. And so uh, that's about all I know. I guess I wasn't much help after all. Sorry about that. I'll uh, just I'll just take my leave here then. Poor guy. Uh, solve the mystery of the sea's legend. So that will be something that we do, obviously, eventually. It seems pretty, you know, pretty important. Even though I think it's just a side quest. But let's go talk to Commander Kamado. See what he has to say. Hmm. So Warden Melly believes that the frenzies of these Pokemon are some sort of trial set by Almighty Sinnoh. We cannot know if that is the case or not, but it does beg the question. Uh, why ever would this Almighty Sinnoh drive the nobles to frenzy? Is it angered by something, or does it seek to drive a wedge between people and Pokemon? Well, far be it from us humans to fathom the thoughts of Pokemon. And what is that space-time rift anyway? What caused it to open? Hmm, but you must be tired. Go on then, to, to the Wallflower. Get some rest while you can. I've instructed Benny to prepare, prepare you his finest potato mochi. Once more, mochi for me. Scaling perilous heights complete. So let's get him. Um, let's get him. Um, potato mochi. Dinner on Kamado tonight. Eat your fill. All right. Oh, what an enticing aroma. My appetite just went through the roof. Quite a change from the commander's usual preaching about tightening our belts until things grow more stable. Well, I've heard talk that our progress surveying Pokemon has made gathering ingredients a less onerous or at least da less dangerous task. It's almost like a fairy tale, isn't it? How you've fallen to us from the sky and gone on to help the people of Hizui so much? Indeed, taking on such a perilous du such perilous duties has earned you a great deal of trust, Sea Dog. It's like I always say, behavior is a mirror that reflects one's true nature. You let your actions do the speaking for you, Z-Dog, and the message is clear as day. It doesn't matter one whit where you came from. You're part of the Survey Corps and Jubilife Village now. Eat up. The next day. Here we are, another day in. Isn't it nice getting up early? <laughs> is it? It's not as if getting up early changes what you could do with the day. Yes, it does. It opens up possibilities, such as responding to Commander Kamado's invitation today in a timely manner. Well, I got the same invitation. I had to wake up even earlier than you all to run all the way here for it. Come on, no need to grouse so much over a nice little early wake up. Are you coming too? I'm sure we can all guess what the Commander wants with us. Yes, do come. Galaxy Hall is quite close anyways. I'm probably going to try to, you know, tidy up some missions really quick before I go in. I'm glad I got my next star. Oh, no, we're already in. Never mind. <laughs> All right. What is it, Commander Kamado? You've now quelled the frenzy of four nobles. On to the next one. When word of these frenzies arrived from all over Hizui, I feared that what would become of us. But here we are, already preparing to quell the final noble. Yeah, who would have dreamed some stranger who tumbled out of the sky would be our salvation? Life never does stop surprising you. The only lord left to be quelled is Avalug, which lives in the Alabaster Icelands. He is also the largest of the, of the nobles, according to what Irita told me. Alright, so a bigger target. Your mission is to quell Avalug, the final lord, and perhaps in doing so we may trigger some change in the space-time rift as well. Alright. Avalug may be the Pearl Clan's noble, but my clan and the Galaxy team will have to step up to resolve this too, for the sake of a brighter future. Then let us all meet in the cold reaches of Alabaster Icelands. Until then. Alright. We'll go. I will. No matter how many of these frenzied Pokemon you may quell, the fact remains that you are a stranger to our world. 
No small number of people still regard you with suspicion and distrust. The most you can hope for is to gain the trust of as many possible, and to do that, you must prove yourself through your actions. All right, and she's, yeah. Whoa, what's happening? Oh, she, she did she fall? What happened? Oh, a worm pulls in here. Uh, Abra, teleport this worm pull outside at once. Abra's not gonna do it, or they're gonna do it, but black out the screen so I can't see it. All right. Ahem. So, you're to survey the Alabaster Icelands next. This is the most treacherous climb you'll face in all of Hizui. It would not be an exaggeration to say that you might be the only one among the Survey Corps to, I can task with surveying the Alabaster Icelands. You know your orders. See your mission through. Great. So, uh, uh, should I get one more slot? Teach me. Maybe I can get two more. I don't know. Let's just take, let's get one more. 9,000. Let's do it. There you go. I caught a lot today, so it's all good. I'm good, maybe later, maybe later. So, uh, I do wanna tidy up some missions really quick before I step outside. I don't know what I, I, I don't know which ones I, I, I can do or have done, um, but there's like a couple things. She obviously wants to talk to me. Tell me, tell me, please. Hey, what's that Pokemon up there? What's its name, what's it do? Who? What? Oh, it's Magikarp. Magikarp? Why is it called Magikarp? Is it a cool Pokemon? Is it strong? Can it fly? No, it can't fly. Why can't it fly? Aren't those flappy things its wings? Tell me, tell me. They're fins. Tell me more, please, please. You're gonna learn more about Magikarp, right? Can you tell me when you're all done with this page in your Pokedex? Yeah, I can. I can do that. And then, let's look at the map. Uh, okay, only one other thing. A new request, probably for the farm. But I also need to check and see if there's anything I can, can do to turn in. Yeah, this is the farm stuff, right? No? No, I can't tell. What's up? I'm telling you, Burmy is the Pokemon with a cloak made of leaves. No, no, Burmy cloaks are made of minerals like sand and rock. I'm quite sure of it. Ha, if it ain't covered in trash, it ain't a Burmy. <laughs> this conversation is getting us nowhere. And you both sure you've actually seen a Burmy before? It wasn't some other Pokemon? We might ask you the same thing. I've seen Burmy here in Hizui, and I've seen them back in my own region too, and guess what? They're all covered in trash. Oh my, you must have gotten confused somehow, my dear. Please, both of you. We're just repeating the same arguments over and over at this point. Hey, you're from the Survey Corps, aren't you? We could figure out... Uh, which of us is right pretty quick if someone brought us an actual Burmy. Catch one and show it to us, would you? I don't know if I have one. Pokemon covered in leaves. This is a Burmy. No, this isn't the Burmy I'm familiar with. Burmy is the Pokemon with a cloak made of leaves. Once you two see it, they'll have to admit I was right all along. Is this a mineral one? What is this? Burn. I can't even see. There we go. Take a good look, both of you. This little one is the real Burmy. I guess it looks pretty similar, but there's no way this is a Burmy. Yeah, I gotta agree. Where's the, where's its trash at, huh? Honestly, how could someone still be in doubt after seeing a real Burmy up close? I suppose we'll need to compare it to those false Burmy to prove the point. Can you carry on until you brought both the Burmy lookalikes that, that the two speak of, spoke of, my dear? All right, so catch another Burmy as well. And then, uh, let me take a look at the missions and requests. Sorry, missions and requests over here. We just did uh, scaling perilous heights. So these requests here. Catch a nose pass and give it to Gully. I don't know where that is. That's obviously something like if I if I see him, I can do it. If I run into him again, I can do it. 
Mistrebius the hair. Do I have a Mistrebius? I might have a Mistrebius. Let's go see. I don't actually know if I still have one. All right, a Rezu. Hey there, in the mood for a style change? About your request. Give me that mischievous. Oh, I don't have it yet. <laughs> I thought I did. See, I didn't know. I thought I might. Anyway, this seems like a good stopping point. So let's, uh, we'll continue on next episode. Uh, I will see you then. Goodbye and thanks for watching. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.